you're looking for some inspiration for your Hobonichi cousin for your weekly view, then stick around. This video is for you. Grab a cup of coffee, pull up a chair, and let's get planning for the week of May 29th through June 4th. Hi, welcome or welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time seeing my hands, hi, I'm Erin of Playing Life with Erin and I'm so happy you decided to stop by and check out this video. And if you're returning, hey, how have you been? Okay guys, so we're gonna be planning for the, for the week of May 29th through June 4th. Um, so I am actually pre-filming this. If you're new to the channel, I typically plan on Monday morning for my week. Um, but I'm actually filming this on May 26th, it's Friday. And the reason is, is because it is Labor Day, no, Memorial Day weekend. I always do that. So Memorial Day weekend and it's Joe's birthday on Monday. So I'm going to have a house full. I'm going to have my kids home, my husband home, and um, we have plans to hang out with my parents. And I just want to chill and relax on Monday. So we're going to get my week all set up today. Um, and we're going to be using Coffee Monster Co. We're going to be using Desert Stroll. I love these colors. Um, and I just planned my monthly. That will actually go up on Wednesday, May 31st. So you guys will be seeing this on May 29th. Happy Memorial Day. Um, and the monthly for June will go up on the 31st. So be on the lookout for that. And if you haven't had a chance to subscribe to the channel, do so now if it's something you're interested in doing and then hit the little bell notification so you're always notified when we come out with something new on the channel. Um, but I did the June theme um, for Coffee Monster Co. And it was like these pretty like yellows and browns. So I thought this was um, nice to start off my month, very complimenting. And also it's gonna be a beautiful next week. So I've been waiting to use this. So. Okay, um, I think I might bring in this tan grid washi. It seems to complement it nicely, um, but we'll see what we do with that. And the colors that I picked um, to go with this spread, I actually think I might grab a green too, but so far we've got yellow, it's 991. And then I have this really nice, um, this is my go-to neutral, it's N79. These are both Tombos. Um, and I think I kind of want to maybe throw in a green if I have one that is complimenting. It doesn't have to be matchy-matchy, but let's see what these three greens bring for us. Now, I have a million swatches on here. Yes, yes, I know. If I had only written down what color that one was, because that one probably goes the best, but I had a guess. I'm going to say it's this one. Ha. Ah. Ha. All right, and we're gonna bring in some Tombow 158. That was easy peasy. Put these back. Okay, and I will put my little notebook swatching book away. Let's see, what else? Oh, and I also have this leftover from my monthly kit. I don't think I'm gonna use it in here though, so I'm gonna put this off to the side. I think I'm actually gonna use this in my Hobonichi Weeks. That'll be a reel that'll be up on Instagram next week. Okay. Deep breath, Saren. I feel like this is the first week in a while that I haven't used like pink or green. <laughs> okay, so what color do I want to do this week? You know what, we're gonna start off, we're gonna be happy and we're gonna start off with yellow. I like to highlight my week and then I start off on my sidebar normally um, and I start with a tracker for the Miracle Morning and then I do a sleep tracker. So the sleep tracker is in this pretty green so let's do, mm, I could do it in yellow. You know what, we're gonna do it in this neutral color. Hopefully it's not too gray. It might be. Mm. I do have this brown. Hold on guys, even though I just did, I just did that there, that's okay. Um, usually I'm not super duper picky, but I think this might work. However, it might be too dark. Also, so let's let's swatch it, guys. Ooh, okay, I like that better. So it's basically the color combo, and it matches perfect. So, what can one do? Let's see. Normally, I just do a highlight, but maybe do I have? Maybe we can use one of these. Let's do this because it has a nice little sun on the side. 
and we'll just cover it. And this will be my miracle morning instead of, okay, that's not terrible. I don't mind that. Now for my miracle morning, I do, I do my lines in the um, Energel Clina just because I feel like it dries a lot faster. Now this pen, if you're new to the channel, this is a uh, Paper Me Ink Joy pen body, but inside here is Sarasa ink, and I actually am going to change it out on here with you guys because this one's running out. And the reason why I do this is because I don't like this pen body for the Sarasa. I really, really like the um, the Ink Joy body, but ooh, look at that. All done. Okay, so let's do this and just load it on in. I use the same body every time. I have a whole package of these. Um, but the Ink Joy, for me, it, it bleeds too much in the um, in the Hobodichi. All right, let's see. I need just like a scrap of paper. I have so many notebooks and pads and paper all over the place. But yeah, I can't find any when I'm looking for them. All right, let's move that out of the way. That's my to-do list for today. So we got Saturday, Sunday, Friday, Thursday, Wednesday, Tuesday, and Monday. So if you are new to the channel, I do The Miracle Morning. I read the book back in January. It's by Hal Elrod. Um, and it's basically an acronym. It's Lifesavers. And the acronym stands for... Silence, which is meditation in my house. Meditation. Um, affirmations. Which I write in a little affirmation journal. Um, so it's silence, affirmations, visualization. Which for me ties into my meditation and even into my affirmations. So like, it's just visualizing like the type of day you want to have or the week or broader. And it can be the kind of life that you want to live, you know, that kind of thing. Um, exercise, which we have been epically failing at, but typically when we, we are doing it, we do some Tai Chi. I want to throw in some, um, hit interval workouts. Now that school is going to be getting out soon. I'll have more time in the morning. Um, what else? Let's see. Silence, affirmation, visualization, exercise, um, reading, and journaling or scribing. I tend to do a lot of these in the morning. They don't all have to be done in the mornings, which doesn't fit in your schedule in the mornings. Don't, don't feel bad about it if you decide to read the book and you think, oh, well, I can't get up early to do that. I have this, that, and the other thing to do. Um, that's fine. You can work it into your day. Um, but I have noticed a little side note, because I really haven't talked about the Miracle Morning other than explaining what it is too much. Um, I have, I like to read, but I don't make time to read. So if you're like that, let me know down in the comments. Um, but since I, I put this on very crooked, since I started the Miracle Morning, um, I've been reading in the mornings. Even if that's like, sometimes it might be the only thing I'm doing. Um, oh, I just read my paper. <laughs> I'm going to cry. Well, that's no fun. Okay, well, we're going to cover it anyway, so hopefully it'll be fine. Um, but I've noticed, I think it's crooked the other way now, but that's okay. It's okay. Um, the last, like, so I read two books in the last week. Um but waking up and knowing that I was going to read in the morning kind of made me like want to jump out of bed because I was like really excited to, to read the book. Um, so I don't know if that would help. Like if anybody has struggles with finding time to read or just being excited to get out of bed in the morning. And I know it's just a little thing sometimes, but I've been really excited to get out of bed. Man, that's crooked. Well, um, to finish reading my books. So that's been nice. All right, let's do this top part and then we'll do... My miracle morning highlights. Hopefully nothing else goes down crooked. So today is Friday. My last plan with me last Monday, I talked a lot about the, the Friday before, 
with Wes and he had missed uh, Fun Friday. They take it, they had taken it away from him and I appreciate all the support. Um, guys, I haven't had a chance to answer all the comments as of this video as I'm filming, but I promise I will get to them um, tonight or tomorrow morning. But for everybody who has reached out, um, whether you are a parent or an educator, thank you so much. I appreciate all the support and I love this community that we're building. Um, it's something that I definitely really need and I know there are other people out there that need it too, especially um, just parents in general. But when you're a special needs parent, <laughs> it's tough, it can be tough. Um, and building a community is super important to me. So thank you all for who reached out. Today is Friday, it's morning time, so I'm not sure. I've already reached out to the teachers to find out if um, if he's gonna have fun Friday. I asked on Wednesday, they don't know. So there's that. All right, let's see. Um, I kind of wanna, I don't normally put these headers um, on, the, on, on, the, on the weekend. I like to save a couple and then use them in my daily page sometimes. I kind of have an idea for a spread. Blah! Dropping everything. Um, I'm thinking, I gotta check to see, but I wanna see if I have all the biomes, if I have these little things for the, all the biomes, cause I'm thinking about doing a spread with all of those. So I'm definitely going to keep those for now and see what I got. So let's do this here instead. It's very desert looking. And then we're gonna put our weekend banner right on top. Hopefully on straight. I have trouble with curved things sometimes. Ooh, perfect, that went on great. Now I'm gonna add in I want to add in this washi, but I also like to do these scenes together. And I do like this one. These are all super, super cute. Um, I do want to add in a This Week sticker here. And then maybe... All right. I'm trying to figure out how I want to do this. So I'm going to put it down here. If I use... Let's see. So I don't want to have to stick the sticker on top of it. So I think so many decisions. I don't normally use a to-do list on Wednesday or Thursday, but this is giving me plenty of room if I want to. Okay, let's cut this back. Ooh, I like that. Okay, this is kind of like, it's like the desert. All right, let's see. How does this go on? It goes underneath. Just trying to make sure I line it up right. So yeah, so I'm really hoping Weston, I hope, I hope I don't get a phone call. Although I don't even know if they'd call me. Um, they are supposed to take the bus today. And when he gets upset, he doesn't want to take the bus. And I can't say that I blame him. Um, so I might get a text saying that I got to come get them. Spencer's like, oh, can you come get us early like you did last time? And I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> Trying not to make a habit out of that. But Weston won't let me anyway. So there's that. All right, let's do, let's get this sidebar finished up. We'll do this week, get my tweezers, take a sip of my iced coffee. And just, oh, look, my coffee matches my spread. Totally didn't realize that till now. Um, it's a beautiful day out today. So I have the back door open, got a nice coffee on hand. Ooh, I like these, they're so cute. I stick this in here. I don't normally have a lot. Hmm. Hold on. Please do that. I take like a sticker off and then I'm like, wait, wait a minute. Uh oh. And I'm like kind of all over the place today. But yeah, I decided to have an iced coffee because it's 
beautiful weather outside, although I have this really bad, so if, if you're new, or maybe if you're not new, maybe you don't know this about me, but I have a huge addiction to coffee. I love it. I drink my coffee black. Um, don't come at me. It took many years for that to happen, and it's actually like a little inside joke between Joe and I. Um, we were together for a really long time, and I don't know, like six years, and I was like, hey, where are we gonna get married? <laughs> and, oh, I just made a hole in my paper. Mm. Um, anyway, so he drank his coffee black, and I did not. I was, at that point in time, I was drinking it on the darker side, but I still had cream in it and no sugar, because I really didn't like the sugar. So um, I suddenly started drinking iced coffee black. I could drink iced coffee black, but there was something about hot coffee. I still couldn't drink it black. But Joe and I went on a camping trip, and I forgot to bring my little creamers with me for my coffee. And um, I had no choice but to drink it black and kind of just stuck. So ever, ever since then, I think I was, I don't know, maybe 28, 29, I've been drinking my coffee black. And we joke because I say, um, so we were smokers and he smoked American Spirit and I smoked, I think I was smoking like Parliament Lights or something like that. Anyway, so I switched to American Spirits and I started drinking my coffee black and then within six months he asked me to marry him. So it's like a joke where I'm like, oh, I just had to like fill those, fill that criteria <laughs> to get the proposal. Um, I don't know, it's a little inside joke and a little side note. But anyways, um, I don't know where I was going with that. So let's get to, we're going to do highlighting of my miracle morning. Now, Monday is Memorial Day. We're not going anywhere on Monday. We're actually going somewhere on the Sunday before. So this Sunday. Um, I do still want to highlight my miracle morning because even if I don't get up, I will still be doing it. I'm just kind of nervous to use this brown color. <laughs> We're going to do it. We'll just make it a thin line. And highlight my miracle mornings up here. These colors are fantastic together. I've been excited to use this kit. I really could not bring myself to use this kit until it was warm. Um, so I'm excited. And then we'll throw in the yellow here. Ooh. Okay. Now, Monday is no work and no school. Hip, hip, hooray. <laughs> um, okay. So let's do... It's not... <coughs> oh, excuse me. It's not going to be my normal morning, but I think... I know my parents are coming over. It's Joe's birthday also. So let's do... I did that there to mark no school. And then we did this cheetah. Mm, I kind of like this cactus. Let's stay with the cactus theme. And put this cactus down here. We actually do donut cake for my husband because he loves donuts and his mom did it for him when he was young. So I kind of kept up the tradition. Tradition. There we go. Um, I think I like this guy here. I'll put him there. Oh, shoot. I think he's crooked. Wow, Erin. Oh, no. I don't know if this is going to come up. So I've got to remember to get Dunkin' Donuts donuts for him for Monday. We always do it. And I just kind of stack them up with some candles. It's cute. My kids love it. It's like their favorite breakfast of the year. <laughs> okay. Ooh, I like that. Cute, cute, cute. And let's do, so we've got Memorial Day, Daddy's birthday. I like these post-it notes. I just use them in my monthly spread and I really like them. Um, what else do we need to do? We need to mark working days. So we'll mark those and let's bring a little more green into this, shall we? So we have work on this day and work on this day, I believe, and work on this day, right? Hold on, guys. I got to look. 
I'm gonna find my work schedule. I'm pretty certain it's the second. It's not, we had like this thing, so we have every other Friday off, and I mentioned this in another video. We have every other Friday off. But yeah, we do have work that day. Um, but then something went like a little cuckoo in April. We had like all these Fridays off, and then suddenly like my schedule was completely wrong. Like what I wrote down versus um, what is actually happening. Ow, that's hurt my arm. Okay. Let's see what else we need to put in here. We need to put in what color we want to use, yellow or this brown color. I think we're going to go with yellow. We'll do the bus schedule for my kids. Um, hold on a second. Oh, I need to mark in something that's important here. Three, four. So we have... They have an after-school program. They normally have it on the same day. But Spencer's got delayed to this Thursday. And they'll be taking the bus on these days. Ooh, that's a little dark. That's okay. We'll fix this one. Oh, airplane coming through. I don't know if I gave this disclaimer on this video, but I have my back door open. It's a beautiful day outside. We're in a flight pattern, so you might hear the occasional airplane. I apologize. All right. Um, we're going to do our to-do lists down here. And I want to use yellow. I'm excited. I'm getting my nails done tomorrow. And if all goes well. I know I think I said this on another video. My kids are supposed to be sleeping at my parents' house. So, fingers crossed, guys. Say Hail Mary for me. So far, so good. We are all healthy. And then this way, if they stay over at my parents' house, and then I'm gonna be getting my nails done, and then going out for dinner with the husband to celebrate for his birthday. And just cause, we haven't been out to dinner in a while. Let's do another yellow here. Probably don't need all these to-dos. Some, some weeks I do, some weeks I don't. Um, there is something else, there's a couple things on Friday. Um, Friday, Friday, Friday. I think I would know. I just did my June monthly. And I had to do it because things are getting things are getting real. We're in the home stretch. Just lots of things going on. Let's see. Friday, we have the school dance. That's what it is. So let's do what time is the school dance? I don't even know. I have it written down somewhere. One, two, three, four. I think it's at six. So let's do. Hmm. Let's do this green. We'll put it in here. Unfortunately, Spencer's going to miss her dance class, but that's okay. Um, all right, let's get writing. We'll get my Tombo Brunesque, and we'll put in my work days and all that stuff. So we've got Miracle Morning. I use this as a sleep tracker, which I love been working out really well and then before I forget because I noticed last time I forgot to do this I forgot to write in the days of the week so today is going to be a little bit different because normally I fill in my Monday because I'm planning on Monday but it's not Monday so we're just gonna write in some things Joe has to have surgery on his hand. We went to, I talked about this in my other video, but we went to the hand specialist yesterday and he has, it sounds scary, but it's a giant cell tumor and it's like right in here in his finger and his right index finger. Um, I know, so convenient. Um, but yeah, he has to have surgery like ASAP because I guess it's like eating away at the bone and he needs to be really careful and all the things. So they're going to call on um, next Friday on the 2nd. We have the day of the schedule of the surgery. We just don't know what time it's going to be, but it'll be the week after. So I need to make sure I remember to write that in. All right, let's see. This is my work days. And then we can like put 
my icons on of the things that don't change usually. Let's see, Wes, this is Wes, 4 p.m. Bus day, and then this is Spencer. Hopefully, I think it's just for this week, so. Let's see, school, dance, I'm so excited, it's a 90s theme. 90s. No, I'm gonna be listening to some good music. I know you're jealous. I'm gonna be with a bunch of elementary students jamming out to the 90s. Yeah, you know, like those 1900s. <laughs> okay, so let's write happy birthday, Joe. And then we'll write Memorial Day. And I'm pretty certain my parents are coming over and we're going to have our own little cookout um, and then celebrate for Joe's birthday. But I am going to put a little reminder here and we're going to do it in green if I can find it. Um, somewhere around here, we're just going to put like a little bubble and we're going to write in get donuts. <laughs> get donuts. Um, me and Spencer will probably run out and go get them. And then Weston will have to distract. All right, let's get my emojis out. And you know what? I think I want to add another. No, well, maybe not. I was thinking about adding in. I want to use these posters. I just don't know how I want to use them. Like I feel like, all right, so I'm going to take them off here. Let's see. Let's just do it. Sometimes you just have to jump in. What if I did, ah, okay, I like that. I know it sounds so silly, but I like that. Maybe I'll just like use this to track something like exercise or water or steps. I don't know, but I like it. And if anything, it just looks darn cute. Okay, moving on from there. What do I need for any of my adulting emojis? That's when... That's when all the things that I have to do that are like, you know, the stuff that you don't want to do. Mm, what one did I use this week? I used that guy. Let's use this one. And then we'll put him here. Trash day is Friday, but we need to make sure we remember. On Thursday, which I almost forgot last night. Which, you know, it's understandable. Both of us were kind of like, huh? yesterday after that appointment. You'll hear all about it in my June monthly plan with me. Um, all right, I wanna put a little Dr. Emoti. If I can get it off. Are there any surgery um, emojis? I'm gonna put this in here like this because we should be hearing from the doctor for a time, but I'm actually just gonna put it in like right. Let's do it. Um, let's do it right here. I don't normally do too much before work, but I just want to make sure. So this way, if we don't hear from them, because I think they said between eight and twelve, but at least I can send out a text message reminder to Joe. Did you hear from the doctor for the time? And then, <clears throat> well, because I'm at work, and then I forget everything. Um, how do I want to label it? Let's see. Appointment time. I'm just going to put appointment time. It's just a little reminder for me anyways. Um, yeah, so if we have any... I, I just need one. <laughs> I need one surgery emoji. I don't know if it's something that even exists, but if you guys know of one, just let me know. Like I said, I just need one. Hopefully. Hopefully we're not going to need more than one because that's just not, not cool. <laughs> okay. So Wednesday, I need to pick up my groceries, and I usually do that somewhere around here. What else do we have coming up? Okay, we've got the first of the month coming up. So that means, that means we've got the electric bill. So let's put this in my reminders to do over here, over here. Where do I want to put it? 
maybe I could just put it here. No, um, I'm going to put it down here because this is five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, I'm just going to put it in the 10 o'clock slot because I'm not really doing anything in my planner at 10 o'clock. Um, so we've got, I don't know what to put for, you know, it's a little water one. We don't pay for our water. Well, we do, but not like that. So I'm going to actually put it in here because it's heat and electric that's due. And then the rent is due. Not the rent, the mortgage. But I don't have, so I bought, I'm kind of mad at myself. I bought rent. Maybe I want to use this. Oh, it's not rent though. It's mortgage, but I know it's mortgage. I just want you guys to know it's mortgage. <laughs> and then I can't put this. You know what? I'm going to put this. <laughs> what else is due? Oh, I know. I have like a little um, iTunes. I keep forgetting. It comes out in a second. All right. So let's do rent mortgage, a.k.a. mortgage. And we'll put that here, maybe. I have to schedule the payment. Okay. So let's. Okay. I have my budget meeting that usually happens on Tuesday. How do I want to do it? Let's do, I like this giraffe. We haven't used him. Let's use the giraffe. Actually, you know what? We're going to use the giraffe on for our Sunday budget meeting. Um, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We, um, we definitely need to have a budget meeting because even though we have insurance, we still have to pay for a lot of this surgery so we definitely we have like a payment plan credit card thing set up through them so we have to figure out what that payment is going to be and then work into our budget um so yeah good times good times it's important to have sinking funds for medical but <laughs> we were a little late to the budgeting game and like we've always tried to budget but we um i don't know We've had some trouble in the past. Um, how do I want to do this? I gotta pay bills. Maybe I should put this here and then, oh yeah, I like that. Okay. And then I'll just kind of branch off what I have to pay. Um, yeah, we we had like I had a business years ago. I don't know if I've ever gotten to that with you guys, but we had a um a business years ago and then we ended up closing it down. But it was ridiculously it's been it's been hard. It's been a hard um was it seven years now? Oh my gosh, yeah, seven years. It took us a hot minute to um, kind of get back on track, but happy to report we're back in the black. It might not be much, but we are. So that's good, at least. But because we've had um, issues in the past, we haven't had a good foundation to be able to start, like, beefing up some good sinking funds. So here we are needing surgery and I gotta say it's kind of crazy we have to pay the deductible which thankfully is I say it's low but and I'm not saying this lightly but it's it's lower than it could have been um and then so it's about a thousand dollars for the deductible which is crazy to me I'm sorry if anybody works in insurance I'm sorry but like here in America Rhode Island. <laughs> we, we pay a lot of money for our health insurance. It's like 24 grand a year, maybe a little bit more now. Um, I feel like I shouldn't have to pay for any medical. I feel like all that should cover it. But I mean, I know, I, I know things cost a lot of money. I get it. I get it. I get it before you come at me. But um, I don't know. It's just crazy. So anyways, we have to pay a thousand dollar deductible. Yay. And then the woman says to Joe, oh, and a $500 facility fee. I'm like, for what? I'm sorry. What? <laughs> That's 100% not covered by the insurance company. I'm like, that should be say something. If it's not even like a little bit covered by the insurance company, maybe you shouldn't be charging 500, like $500 to walk in the door. I don't know. I told Joe it's probably for things like the anesthesiologist and stuff like that. I get it. Everybody's going to get paid. Everybody's got bills due and things to pay. Money makes the world go round. But anyways, so if you haven't already, I have done a money stuffing and envelope stuffing um video that one is a few videos down from here check that out and i'm actually going to do another one for this week um 
probably on Wednesday or Thursday because that's payday for us. So let me know down in the comments if you're liking those cash stuffing videos. Um, I'm going to do a reel on Instagram this week for it. Um, but yeah. All right. What else do we want to do here? That was a long explanation for our budget meeting. I feel like I'm forgetting something. So I'm going to take a, hot, a quick little peek at my... Nope. Okay, I don't have anything else that I'm planning for for this week. I've got Joe's birthday, remember the donuts. I wonder if I have a donut one. Ooh, I think I have a self-care bucket list. And I think on there is like treat yourself or something. Let me see. Let me see if I can find it. Mm. I could use one of these. Hold on. I'm a little, little squirrel right now. Let's use one of these family meal ones because I'm 100% positive my parents are going to come over for like a little cookout. I'm going to say probably around here and then let's highlight what color are we lacking in this column. Yellow, green. Let's do green. I'll just highlight it. I'm not going to be doing much on Memorial Day, I'm sure, but I do want to leave myself mom and dad. Well, I'll put cook out. There we go. But I was looking for treat yourself. Let's see if I can find it. Um, <laughs> lazy day, waving. I have so many. Self-care bucket list. Haha, <laughs> I knew I'd had it. Let's see. I swear that, oh, I already used it. <laughs> I need another one of these apparently just so I can use treat yourself. Um, do I have any other ones with a donut? I don't like donuts. That's what's crazy. I mean, like, don't get me wrong. I'll eat a donut. But, um, Joe is, Joe and Spencer, they are one of, one of the kind, those two. I'm not a big fan of, um, of donuts. They give me heartburn, and sometimes it's just not worth it for me. <laughs> but he likes them, so that's why I can't believe I've already. I must have used them for things like going to get myself a nice coffee or something. Mm -hmm. I don't see it. Let's see. Some of these are. Hmm. I don't have one. Let's see. I'm like struggling over here. Oh, there's a birthday cake though. Hmm. That might work. Food. I could use this one. Let me use this one. Because I have to go out to get the donuts. So that kind of makes sense. Right? And it kind of just adds like a little cute emoji right here. Okay. What else, guys? Do I need anything else? Um, after school. I don't have any doctor's appointments. Shocking. This coming week, we have our dance. Um, what else? I think I don't think so. Saturday, we don't have any plans, so I'm just gonna leave that like that. And as I go through my week, I will add to this if I need to. But I just like to have the basic reminders, the things that happen every week. Um, so next Friday, the second will be another um, another vlog video to add to my series. And we will go through this whole week um, in that vlog. So you guys will get to see that and see how this week progresses. All right, guys, that's going to do it for me today. I'm liking, actually, no, I am loving how this came out. I love this color scheme. Ready for the most beautiful week coming up. Nice 80 degree weather, no rain. Like there was 0% chance of participation. No, precipitation um, for the whole week, I think. So, I mean, bad for the plants but good for me because I don't like rain anyways okay so if you guys are interested in subscribing to the channel do so now before you forget um, and then hit that little bell notification so you're always notified anytime we come out with a new video on the channel and as always guys thank you so much for taking time out of your day and hanging out with me I appreciate it so much I know we're really busy so thank you thank you thank you and until I see you again have a beautiful week and keep planning bye